And the difficulty has been notched up a little bit. Until I start running into problems, that's what I'll have it do, because, uh, this is kind of ridiculous how much damage my fists are doing with this this little perk active. Um, anyway, we're in the Embershard Mine now, because I like to come in here before I go anywhere else, just because it's a cool little place. Uh, favorite? Can I favorite this? Or, oh, no, it is favorite. Okay, okay. I'm dumb. Actually, wait a minute. Hotkey. Yeah, there we go. I was wondering how to do that. Or trying to remember how to do that, anyway. So let's sneak down in here. And activate this tripwire. Ooh! Thought you were going to catch me with that, did ya? Did ya? Nope. Not a gonna work on this, Khajiit. He's a smart guy. Oh, I'm gonna go in and poison my bow now. <laughs> and these cocky mofos are gonna get what's coming to them. In the form of frostbite venom into the facer. To the facer. Well, actually, he's going to sleep, isn't he? Hmm. I think I'm gonna wait for him to go to sleep first. Looks like he's settled. What's up? And down. Oh, we got another customer. Oh, over the head. Unfortunate. Oh! Whoop, 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 whoop. Ow! Overestimate the gap. Eh! And down. What did you got on you? Gold, some hide armor, and. I think I've got better of all that, but I'll go ahead and take it just to sell it later, I guess, until my carrying weight gets over, overdone. What's this bandit got on him? Gold armor, no, 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 okay. Hmm, pretty decent stuff. So we have a bridge here, apparently, that we probably should drop on the way into the thing in the place. What were these people cooking? I'm hungry. I just got done fleeing from a dragon. I guess I'll take some mushrooms. That'll do me just fine. Ooh, pickaxe! Doink. 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 Funny, I don't think I was playing Minecraft, but whatever. Uh, that's cool. That's actually the first vein that I've ever noticed in ever playing this game. Um, normally I just skip straight past him just because I'm not really paying attention at the time or something. Well, let's proceed on in here and see what we can see. Oh, dear. Well, this man meant an unfortunate end. I'll take his money, though. Read Tatter Journal. I gotta do the voice. <coughs> Excuse me. They've had me working down here for days now. It's not the time that's getting to me, though. It's these tunnels. I've told them countless times now to add extra supports to the weak sections of the tunnel. If only we had more of those wooden beams that we reinforced with bronze bottoms. Honestly, if I hear the earth shift one more time above my head, I'll be so stressed I may stop drinking for good. I mean, what's a Nord without his mead? Is that the only page? Okay. Oh, well, that's an unfortunate end to that man. I feel sorry for him. Kind of. Sort of. You shouldn't drink and work on the job. It's not good. An avalanche could fall on your head. It'd be horrible. Uh, I'll take that weir beer. Weir, well, I don't know what I was trying to say there. Cabbage! And I think there's nothing else useful here. So what let's do, because once I drop this, it's probably going to get someone's attention is let's get ready for someone to run in here. Uh, I suppose I could go ahead and poison my bow again with some frostbite venom. Hutch cha 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 cha. Sure enough. Oh crap I missed. 
Uh, second shot's the charm. Crap. Crap again. Crap again. Wow. Unequip this. Fist fight time. Whack, whack, whack. In your face. Unarmed. What? I'm pretty sure those are pants, buddy. Unarmed weapon. Huh. Maybe that's something else with the mod. Hang on a second. This is interesting me. Does that actually count as a weapon slot? Holy crap, it counts as a weapon slot. That is hilarious. <laughs> wow. Holy crap. Do I hit harder now? I don't think I hit as hard. Hmm. Well, that's very interesting. I guess that's what added, or what they added in the game. Of course, I did turn the difficulty down that one time. Um, holy crap. Well, let me look at my Khajiit racial and see how much extra damage it's given me. So I can kind of make a decision based on that. Active effects. Khajiit claws do 15 points of damage. Okay. We're going to have to investigate that later, I guess, to see if that's actually really helpful for me to equip that that weapon. Uh, unarmed weapon, as it would seem. Wow. Interesting. That's all I've got to say about that. Very interesting. Now, uh, with that mod, unarmed weapons count as one-handed weapons for the purpose of calculation. So, the combos will include that uh, as the damage type. And I am intending on playing this this one relatively unarmed, unless I find a really awesome weapon. I feel like, oh god! I think I went stealthy. Oh, no! I did not go stealthy at all. One hit took out all that health. I missed. I got her. Alright. So I guess my hands with a Khajiit Claws thing just do a lot of damage for some reason or another. Wow. Equipping that weapon just seemed to make it, like, less good. But whatever. Wow. Alright then. Unlocked with a key that I got earlier? It's good stuff. Iron Greatsword of Embers! Ha! Holy crap. Look at all this nice stuff. Sweet. Uh, these stacks got anything in them? Red apples. Potatoes. Potato. Um, some nice dragon's tongue. A bunch of really awesome ingredients. Nice. Awesome stuff. Oh, that's great. Cool. All right. Well, that being the case, I think we've got just about everything. There's a bucket in there, and I don't think I want it for anything. All right, we're gonna run into this room up here that's got some dudes that we can pick off at range. I think. So let's sneaky, sneaky, sneak up here. Ooh! -wah. I missed. Ooh. Maybe if I can hold out, she will forget I was here. Uh, Alright. Yeah, it's looking that I got hidden. I'm gonna pick off that guy over there instead. Nice. She's coming up here to look for me. I'm gonna hide behind this corner. I don't think she sees me. The more time I can spend sneaking, the better it is. Uh, they're slowly losing track of me, I think. I will get you guys as soon as you stop moving. And hidden. And you're both dead. Crap, miss. 
Ah, oh, miss again. All right, we're gonna have to get into fisticuffs. Whoa! It's gotta be my freaking Khajiit hands. Whoa! Think you're gonna take me? No, 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 no. Wouldn't hit a lady if she didn't have a giant sword. Oh God! Okay, you are dead. Not a big surprise. Oh, so maybe all of these mobs just have unarmed fists. No, I guess it's just every other mob. Hmm. Now here's the weird thing. Iron Groat Great Sword does 16 damage. Unarmed Weapon does 25. That might be a bug. I don't know. That's one thing about playing with all these mods that's making me a little bit iffy. Is all these... What? <laughs> oh, oh! you tell me what this bucket's for. It's off the beaten path, <laughs> protected on all sides. Is there any toilet paper around here? You just kind of, just kind of, oh, well, I guess, I guess I have been traveling for a long time today, so I'm just going to, uh, okay, I'm done. That was awful. That was positively, completely awful. I apologize. <laughs> oh, Lord. Ugh. <sighs> funny. I didn't even notice that until just now. Oh, wow. Ah, uh, iron ore. I, I grabbed that really quick. Oh, hey, a book! Neat. Skill book. They're smithing. How great. I think I did level, actually. So let's go ahead and invest a point in something. Um, what do we got here? Let's go health first. Surely. Surely, surely, surely. And Sneak is the one stat we have been using a lot of. So let's go ahead and do... Uh... Stealth... Yeah, Stealth up. I do love Sneak. Never, never, ever had an opportunity to not sneak up on someone and do some damage. Unless I'm fighting a dragon, but meh, we can find a way around that later. And here's a forge. Eh, let's not use this right now. We can just wait until we get into Riverwood before we start doing all the forging and whatnot. We'll have a tutorial to play with and stuff like that. Yeah, it'll come in due time. Alright, so we're passing on through here pretty quick. The damage on my hands is actually really relative to uh, how I remember it being when I started off the last game. Like, when you first, when you first come out of the tutorial and you run up stuff and you start hitting it as a Khajiit, it hurts people. It is awful. I think I played my um, I played my warrior or spell bow guy kind of like that for the longest time. It worked really well. It was awesome. I'm not really sure what I want to do with this character right now though. I mean, I heard someone tell me that smithing was kind of the way to go. Um, so I might do that instead of Conjuration this time, but it's going to be one of those things I just kind of got to think about and put some time into. And considering all of the care and effort I'm putting into getting all this ore, I think I might actually go smithing on this playthrough. Um, we'll just have to see. Coin purse. Let's see if I can get into this chest really quick. Nope. Eh. Oh, no. I almost had it a second ago. A little more. There we go. Bunch of gold. Ha! Love it. Not. What the? Oh, okay. <laughs> I, was, I was freaking out there for a second. I think I was... Eh, I don't know what the deal with that was. Okay, anyway. Bunch of money. Bunch of tomatoes. Wow. Look at all this stash. These people were loaded. Uh. Uh. Anything else in here I can grab really quick? Ninja and take away from here. 
more of this. I'm just kind of stealing whatever is not tied down right now. I've got plenty of inventory space to carry all of it. Wee. Oop. I see alarms. Let's not rattle any of those. Oh, to Skyrim? Really? That was the whole cave? I don't remember that being the whole cave. Uh, okay. Well, I guess that's our first dungeon completely done with. Let me check the map really quick just to make sure it is, in fact, the first dungeon. Yeah, cleared. All right. So, Ember Shard Mine, completely done. It's a nice little place to get some nice cash and whatnot. Good stuff. And we begin the epic adventure of Reclaw the Khajiit. Type roguish thing, I guess. <laughs> I don't really know what you're going to be, Mr. Kitty Cat, but you're going to be something amazing. So anyway, thank you for joining me in the first chapter of this wonderful Let's Play. I hope to see you all in the future. Goodbye.